there's a lot of diversity in Minnesota. Growing up, I always had the sense that we are a place where we value each other's differences. I've always felt like this is my home. I belong here. I am a Minnesotan, and I always will be. My name is Justine Nelson. I live in St. Paul, Minnesota, and Teresa is the love of my life. We wake up at 6, and it is full speed ahead. We brush our teeth, get dressed. Teresa's running around like crazy, getting the backpacks ready, getting lunches ready. She's the rock in the household. She's the one who makes sure everything happens. Thank you. Kiss. Have a nice day. Um, Margaret is our extrovert. She is a chatty thing. She loves art. She loves sports. She loves everything. And she seems to have a knack for most of it. Rosie is very different. She just started to talk. Just boom, just chat, chat, chat about everything. She loves cooking. She loves gardening. And I feel like she's coming into her own. Teresa is the love of my life. She is always there for me. She's the most handsome woman I've ever seen, and she takes my breath away after 10 years of being together. When I meet people for the first time, there's no word I can use to describe to them who she is. I'm, I'm hoping that people will vote no, and I'm asking them to vote no, so that someday in the future, I'll be able to introduce her as, this is my wife, Teresa. That feels right. I'm Michael Cole Smith, and my husband's name is Jamil Smith Cole. Today is our third year wedding anniversary, our fifth year being together. We do something big every year. This year, we're just taking it easy. Michael, he is charming. He challenges me every day. We pull off each other's energy. He's amazing. He's brought the sense of family into my life. I love him to death. We share custody of a seven-year-old daughter. Her name is Madison. She's in Detroit right now for the school year. <laughs> Nothing about our situation is any different from anybody else. I fell in love with him. He fell in love with me. I'm committed to him, mind, body, and soul. It's been three years since the wedding. We are a married couple. We want to legalize it. This is good. It is. I'm Regina, and that's Marika, and uh, we've been together for 12 years. We fell in love pretty darn fast, and it kind of took both, both of us by surprise. The instant that we locked eyes on each other, uh, I, I, I fell, and that was it. June is wonderful. She is smart. She's feisty. I had no idea uh, how much that they change you. We were saddened that we had to hire a lawyer to make sure that if anything happened to me during childbirth that Regina would have rights to the child. I rarely think about the fact that I am in a same-sex relationship until there's a something that I can't get. Like, I can't cover both Regina and June under my health care, and, and that sucks. I'm a librarian, and Regina's a teacher, and we come home from school and work and plop on the couch like everyone else and have dinner together. It would be really nice if we could just be treated like the normal couple that we are. <laughs>